Hello, how you doing? Welcome back once again. On the menu today, really, really simple and absolutely delicious. We're gonna make some carrot rice. We've got some beautiful stuff in there, some cumin seeds, black mustard seeds, garlic, ginger, onion, cilantro, coriander, and of course, rice and carrots. It is delicious and vegan. Okay, this is super easy and absolutely delicious, this one. Okay, rice, I'm using a basmati rice, so cooked rice. Now, cold rice works well. If you've got one day old rice, it's beautiful. This is actually from yesterday. So what that means is it's really kind of dried out. It's not going to stick together. Grated carrot, cilantro or coriander, onion, cumin seeds, black mustard seeds, optional fresh chili, and garlic ginger paste. We're going to start this off with a little bit of oil and add some salt and pepper. Like I say, super easy, super, super delicious. So here I am, I've got a nice frying pan here and I've got some oil in there. I've, I'm using sunflower oil, you could use something different if you want. Let's start by dropping in the black mustard seeds and the cumin seeds and just for a few seconds, let them do their thing. They'll infuse the oil and give it a delicious flavor. So don't skip this part. Just a few seconds in need. Then we're gonna add in our onion and our carrot at the same time. We're on quite a high heat as you can see and hear and I'll be back in three minutes. Keep it moving. Really beautiful. Let's now add salt, some black pepper, and our garlic ginger paste. Now garlic ginger paste is a 50-50 mix of garlic and ginger. We use it all the time here. You can make it really easily, or you can actually buy it no problem in most stores these days, depending on where you live, of course. Okay, two more minutes, stand on this high heat, keep it moving all the time. Super, super easy. Gonna drop in those optional fresh chilies. Now, if you wanted, you could drop in a couple of teaspoons of curry powder or something like that. That'll really flavor it up and of course, color the rice. Talking of rice, let's get that in now. Cold, one day old rice is best, but definitely cold. Stay on the high heat, four minutes, keep it moving. We are so, so nearly done. This is gonna be so delicious, really, really. I hope you can hear that. That is your rice frying. You actually do need to fry it. If you get a little bit of color on it, like a little browning on the rice, that's actually quite nice, I find. Off goes the heat. Fresh cilantro or coriander, whatever you may call that. One last little mix. Delightful. I see you at the table. And there you go, I told you, super easy. That is absolutely delicious. I do hope you enjoy that. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. That helps us out a great deal. A thumbs up is beautiful. And a comment letting us know that you're fine is fabulous. We'll see you soon. Lots of love. Thank you very much for taking time to watch our cooking videos. Hope you enjoyed them. Lots going on. We've got a, a new vegan channel, which we're trying to promote at the moment. Just 100% vegan, so please check that out. Chef June has started his own Filipino cooking channel. He's still going to be appearing here with me on how to cook great, but he started his own one. 
and we've got Rahel who's doing great stuff on her Amharic or Ethiopian cooking channel. So if you're into either of those things or those three things, please check them out. The links might pop up here or they'll be down below. If you'd like to support the channel, which I really do hope you do, you can by buying us a cup of coffee. It's going to cost you a couple of dollars. Just follow the link, PayPal or whatever it is. Um, really, really would help us if you do that. I think that's about it. We're doing fine. We hope you're well. Subscribe to us. That helps us out a lot. Give us a thumbs up. We do like that. And more importantly, please do leave us a comment. We do like to hear from you and see what you're up to. That's it. Be safe. Be well. We'll see you soon. Lots of love.